Good morning, everyone. Welcome. And for everybody that was wondering, we have rumors, confirmed and unconfirmed. So far with Chick-fil-A, the reopening looks to be for mid-October. And in Wawa, Wayne Avenue looks to be, what, December? But no date exactly. The Dollar Tree is definitely opening soon in the old Walgreens store by Taco Bell. I've seen the proof. And unconfirmed, that Korean barbecue place in the old Chris's kitchen is still under construction and haven't heard about any info as far as when they're opening as of yet. And the place going in the old Exxon on Radio Hill, the structure is going up, but it still looks like they have a long way and I haven't heard a word of what's going in there. If anybody knows, drop a comment down below. We'd love to hear. Everybody's heard about what's happening down in North Carolina and uh, the dock workers and such. And as a result, apparently, at least the effects on people is trickling up here as well. There's a, a bunch of rumors about things starting to run out and people having problems finding things. And even on Facebook, here's a post talking about the fact that these people are saying that there's things running out and they're worried. And there's a person on this post stating that they work for Walmart and they're saying the things are in stock. They're coming back in. They're just a matter of putting them out enough to get people covered. So. Don't freak out, don't panic. We're gonna be okay. Most of the things you truly need are made here in the good old US of A and we should be covered. Time for the police report. The police report brought to you by me and Pennsylvania State Police in Fayetteville on Mon Alto Road had a report of criminal mischief under $1,000. Looks like someone's damaged somebody's housing siding. And the PA state troopers are investigating. In Green Township, Franklin County, Chambersburg, there was a report of a mailbox theft. Two packages were taken and someone had driven away with them containing Amazon gift cards in the amount of $280 and cabinet locks valued at $47.36. Uh, they are investigating. Hopefully they get some information on that soon, but I'm telling you with the Christmas season, keep an eye on your packages on the porch and even in your mailbox. It's time for the Gas Buddy Report. The top 10 gas stations in Chambersburg, PA area. First off, Walmart Chambersburg at 287. BJ's Chambersburg 287. Edders, Fayetteville, 289, Sitco, Chambersburg, 289, Pit Stop, Chambersburg, 295, Sunoco, Fayetteville, 299, Blue Ridge Summits, Sunoco at 315, Exxon, St. Thomas, 319, and both Waynesboro Rudders, 323. That's been the Gas Buddy Report. The Chambersburg Recreation Department is having a creative pumpkin crafting class and also some other fall projects. You can get in on that and enjoy some snacks and refreshments while learning that. And its ages are from six to 12. The October 25th date is from 5.30 to 7 p.m. Cost is $39, borough residence is $29. Registration deadline is October 18th and that's on the Chambersburg Rec at PA, chambersburgpa.gov. See events for October 5th and 6th, 2024 for Chambersburg, PA, Franklin County, PA, and beyond. Things to do. Have a good one. Check them out. And that's been the news for October 4th, 2024. I'm Frank. Hope you enjoyed the show. We will see you again on Monday.
Have a good one.